Officially spring and longer, sunnier days are finally in sight. But as we move into a new season, the risks associated with the work that we undertake change. Let's take a look at them here. Spring weather conditions such as rain, fog and glare can all reduce visibility and subsequently lead to road traffic incidents and collisions. As well as this, we may also see an increase in the number of cyclists using the roads as the weather conditions improve not to mention emerging wildlife who are known to bolt into the road unexpectedly. But engineer Colin isn't going to let these changes jeopardise his safety. So he's keeping his vehicle clean to ensure maximum visibility, remaining focused on the road by turning down the radio and avoiding conversations with passengers, and slowing down to allow more time to react should a hazard appear. Colin is also aware that the change in spring weather conditions may have an effect on risks when working out on site, like spring showers, which can increase the likelihood of slip, trip and fall incidents. But by wearing our steel cap safety boots and sticking to pathways, we can improve our grip and tread when traversing through water. And don't forget to report any defective equipment or PPE to a line manager without undue delay. Improvement in weather conditions throughout spring can also mean an increase in temperatures. The hotter weather can result in heat-related illnesses, sometimes causing dehydration, stress, rashes and heat stroke, all of which can be avoided by taking regular breaks and drinking enough water. But Colin knows that should this happen to him, recovery will occur after resting in a cool area and consuming cold salted drinks. Those who suffer from hay fever may experience heightened symptoms due to increased pollen levels. Colin's safety spectacles will help limit pollen entry into the eyes. And to be safe, he's notifying his management team of any hay fever medication consumption due to drowsiness. Increased exposure to the sun's UV rays during spring can also cause short and long-term damage to our eyes and skin. So to protect himself against this damage, Colin is using an SPF and wearing his safety sunglasses. The increased presence of insects and animals during the summer months raises the risks of bites and stings. So to limit his skin's exposure and reduce the risk of bites and stings, Colin is wearing his full long-sleeved PPE. Daylight saving time can cause disrupted sleep cycles, resulting in fatigue. This can increase the likelihood of workplace incidents, RTAs and personal injuries. So if Colin feels unsafe to work, he knows to escalate this to his line manager or a member of the health and safety team. And if tiredness prevents him from going about his normal life, he'll make an appointment with his GP. Invasive species such as giant hogweed contain toxic sap which can cause severe burns when in the presence of sunlight. Luckily, Colin knows not to touch it and will call a member of the health and safety team if this is unavoidable. Your Thames Water Zero Compromise card enables you to stop any activity that can't be undertaken safely. Please don't walk by.